What's up guys? Today we have this odd, kind of unique little setup on a very small front yard flyer. Popeye's so excited to fly, so let's get this thing in the air. Hey everyone, I'm Nate. And I'm Abby. Popeye's here hanging out with us in the front yard, ready to chase a drone. Amelia's taking a nap inside. It's a beautiful, warm spring day outside. We're in the front yard doing some yard work and through movie magic, I'm guessing you guys can tell because of the same Batman shirt. We recorded two videos in one day. We have the LBLA7727 micro drone with folding arms. Now this little guy is slightly too big to fly inside, so I wanted to fly it in the front yard on a calm day. That's exactly what we have going on today. I couldn't ask for better weather, so let's put this in the air, let Popeye have a little bit of fun with it. Are you ready, buddy? Let's fly. Can you guys tell I am proud of my work? <laughs> and this puts it in the air safe from Popeye. So let's hit the auto takeoff button. And there we go, we're in the air. I am pulling back full back and it's gone so slow. So I have to find rates really fast. Like really, 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 really fast. Okay, there's rate three. This may very well be designed to uh, be an indoor flyer because if that's my third rate that's really slow at least going backwards everything else is fast well look at that why is backwards Whoa, so slow go? Uh, can you see me no you need to go up in the sky okay let's go higher thank you now this is fun to fly i like this okay we'll go a little higher how's that how's yes, that little there. drone easy for me to see hard for abby to see because she's looking at like a little two and a half inch screen there but look at this guy look at it Shoo. So why was it slow going backwards? I don't know, I'm gonna try that again. Pulling back and slow. For some reason they've just huh. turned the rate down for reverse flight. But this drone does have altitude hold. Now I'm totally hands free right now. The breeze is pulling that away into the pine trees. Probably hard for you guys to see it now. But I do have that bright little headlight on there. So what I'm gonna do is fly it closer for you guys to see. Hopefully Abby can track it. I'll put it in a lower rate. I'll go rate two. And uh, it looks good, easy to fly. I like the shape of it. I like how those arms kind of are out like a crab, right? The mm -hmm. little like claws on a crab or something. It looks pretty cool. So this nice. doesn't have a camera? No camera, at least not on this version, but I think there is a version with a camera. Uh, we do have a flip button, so I'm gonna try that. And look at that, red light on the back. And a lot of people like red lights on the back of their toy grade drones because it reminds them of the tail lights on a car. So, okay, let's try flips. Hey, it did a flip. Unlike yesterday's drone, the 3D button, or this one says 360 flip, just like the other one yesterday, the other one just had a really slow yaw rotation. And this drone is way cheaper than yesterday's drone, and I like it a million times more. This is just a fun to fly little drone. Super light, 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 light weight, which is awesome, and zips around really well. This is, this is good. I mean, you could fly this inside too. Do you want to fly this, Abby? Very easy to fly. I'm just going to pass the controls while mid-flight. Just remember that pulling back on it is very slow. And I'm at the camera. It's been a I really long time there. since I've flown a drone. <laughs> like, since the day I went into labor. <laughs> oh my gosh. Well, you've gotten short snippets of flight, like inside, but you haven't been flying outside much, have you? It's nice, isn't it, to get out here? Sometimes I forget the controls. <laughs> You look like you remembered pretty quickly the way you're doing cyclones and stuff. Well, cyclones are easy. You just push both sticks over. Yeah. That's not hard at all. But if you're not good at correcting your orientation after you've messed up, that can be a really finicky pickle to get yourself into. Well, the red light on the back makes it really easy. It does help. I mean, it's bright. Like, it I can bright. see it on the camera easily. Yeah. I didn't test all the functions, I'm not saying you have to. It's a nice little drone. See where the flip button is? What do you think about that? I'm trying to find the flip button. Bottom right really corner. Easy, really weird, isn't it? At because least everything's labeled. It's labeled very it's well. Just, there's a lot to look at. Like it's kind of chaos on the It's like you have to read a book. Yeah. I think the wind fairly well now. I think so too. The only issue was I, I didn't realize because how many drones have low reverse rates, right? Like I didn't realize, I was like, oh no, this thing is going to be way too sensitive to fly outside. But just push it forward. Just don't fly backwards very much. I think it's a fun little drone. How much is this? 
I can't remember off the top of my head, but you know what the beauty of that is? There's a link in the description I have a link in the description box below. Sometimes a person will stop by and say, hey Nate, how much is this? Um, I yeah. could tell you. Price changes too Price much. Price is, oh, it's so hard. Even on like really steady brands out there, like Horizon Hobby, you remember how much the Axial Yeti XL used to be? Did you and think then, I was going in the tree? Uh, well, I just kind of lost you, like, oh, on the camera. Okay. Yeah. I had to look up to find you. And then they dropped the price on that Axial Yeti XL, like, almost half. There you go. You didn't want to do a backflip? Hmm, maybe it can't do backflips. You know what, Abby? Nope, the right matter. stick, I just looked at your controller while you were pulling back. It gets stuck. Pull back harder, and I'll bet it will. Try backflip again. Don't you see it? Do it. I, I think it will. Is that why you think it? Yep. Mm hmm. It got stuck. There it is. Ah, yep. Oh my oh, gosh. Whoa. What just happened? Three. I don't know. That's, that's what it is the right joystick or the uh, right hey, yeah, gimbal. That's why it's so weird going back. Yep. It just feels like it's, it's as far as it'll go, but mm -hmm, has a little little point there. Yeah. Well, that makes sense why we were having issues. Yep. Let's see. We got. Forward tram, left tram, right tram. So that whole little section is pointless. Emergency <laughs> stop, auto takeoff, auto land. One key return, which I really don't. Nah, want to don't do it. Don't do it. Oh, okay, so all right. Do it. Go ahead. This is like your first time ever testing this oh outside. You hit it. Yeah. There it goes. It's coming right back to you. And then you took over. You stopped it. Yep. And you probably have headless mode if you have yeah, one key return. Look at it. It's mode. pretty much coming back. I don't do headless mode. Yeah, that's okay. That's okay. It can be confusing. It is. I don't think it's helpful at all. It's never, I've never found it helpful, I don't think. The only time it Jesus. would be is to a very first time drone flyer with like a GPS drone, you're out in a big field and you say, hey, all you gotta do is push this right stick and it'll go away no matter which way it's facing. So why did that do like three flips that one time? Uh, I think just because it, you, you like held the button down and it like, I don't know. And we've had that happen before though. <laughs> it's not gonna do that back one. <laughs> oh, that's funny. And you tested all the speeds. Yep. Okay, so now we're just on battery life, right? I guess so, and How just enjoying the day. Um, six and a half minutes, about. So that's a good flight time for a little guy. Oh, yeah, but you're fighting it really well, no problem. Isn't it funny how Popeye will bark for like the first 20 seconds or so, and then he's like, okay, I just want to watch, just enjoy the flight. <laughs> he's, he's laying down at our feet. We Is that have, auto landing? No, we don't oh, okay. have a camera during the show you guys today. <laughs> hmm. That's what he's doing. Here, I'll, I'll, so I'll sweet. get Popeye. <laughs> there he is. Just hanging out, just watching us. Just watching us fly. Darken it back up so I don't blind everyone. <laughs> and there you are, cool. What you think, Popeye? I think this is a winner, definitely. It's unique, it's different, and I like that. And I think that's what Popeye would say too. He's not very interested right now. It's okay, he's just hanging out, just watching. Yep. It's like, um, it's good. I'm really impressed with this flight time, really impressed. We're up to seven and a half minutes on a little drone, and we've been fighting wind and doing flips and all the different rates and stuff. This is really good. Yeah. Fighting the slight breeze really well. Yeah, especially considering how lightweight it is. But I am, I'm having to point my nose right into it so I don't get too confused. Mm -hmm. So you can always just keep pushing away. Yes. Cool. Okay, well, I got a question for everybody. What drone are you most looking forward to flying this spring and summer? If you live in the kind of same areas as we do, it's been winter, you've been stuck inside most of the time, and now we're looking I'm, I'm shopping online are you guys shopping online maybe you bought something a month ago that you've just been like oh i'm waiting for good weather to take this out what is that drone for you guys is it a dji inspire or is it just a handful of toy drones like this i would like to know just let us know in the comments below i like talking to everybody you know even if i don't reply a lot of times i'm sitting on the couch after i've eaten dinner or something on my phone i'm just looking at all the comments sometimes abby and i'll read the comments to each other of course people that we recognize all the time cool. there, yeah yeah, yeah. awesome oh there's another one nice they're fighting for their mate the two men can you believe it we're up to nine 
minutes I now. No, I was thinking like five at best. This is really a nice drone. Now, if you were flying on a lower rate inside, you'd probably get another minute or two out of this because you're not having to give it inputs and it's right. fighting the wind all the time. Wow. Yeah, very cool. This is a nice little drone. You can charge it anywhere too because it charged via USB cable. Nice. So that's really cool. Yeah, good day to fly. I'm so happy that we're out here. So happy. The wind has picked up, so that was full see. forward there for a second. Okay, but I think you're in rate two still. Yes, I am. So you can always increase that if you like emergency. I'm really distracted by these birds. <laughs> I know you can't see them, but... No, this is nice. This is like the earliest we've ever gotten to get outside and do RC videos. I feel like, I feel like since we've lived here, we've never really been outside this time of the year this much. No, I don't think we have. But then again, we're probably just like maybe getting cabin fever. Yes, yes we are. <laughs> we got the kiddo and going stir crazy. Cool. I like this. I am amazed at the really flight time. It's a good flight time when you run out of talking points. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't expect this at all. I didn't say, I didn't brag about flight time. And you know what? I like that. You got all these drones that are like, we have a 25 minute flight time. And then you fly it and you get like a 15 minutes. And so you're disappointed. You shouldn't be because 15 minutes is still good. But this drone didn't seem to brag, at least not on the box, about a flight time or anything. And here we are expecting a five, six minute flight time and we're pushing 11 minutes now. I, I can't believe this. This might be the longest flight time we've ever had on this small of a drone. Yeah. Really impressive. Cool. This is just a really good one to keep charged at your computer if you're if you work at home or something or you just like you edit like we do you know we're always editing and so maybe you just play video games a lot you could charge this on your xbox or your playstation through the usb and then when you're ready in the later evening you could step out front and just have a blast flying this get a nice cold lemonade sit out on the front porch fly your drone for a nice long time get some fresh air sun enjoy the weather and then feel accomplished for the and day go back in okay so let's do an auto land long press stop that's not what we want to do just just I'm touch it landing. there you go and i'm going to steer it down but okay it's descending by itself but i'm steering it that is almost that's about 11 and a half minutes wow that's really good i just checked and this is about 27 $28 on Amazon. Now the price will fluctuate some, but we'll have a link in the description box below. And I'll just tell you before the end of the video, I think this is definitely worth that, especially because of the flight time. So if I were you, I'd go ahead and pick one up. But this is kind of what makes it super unique, this transmitter. You see all the labeling there? Can can they see that, Abby, mm -hmm. from here? Yeah. That's it's crazy. Kind of chaotic, but it is. at least it's labeled. And, and it's they listened, Nathan. They labeled it. They Don't labeled complain it. about the labels. Nope, nope. It's just in such a weird layout. Like the flip button is down here. Yeah. Right? It's just so There's weird. There's no shoulder button. No, none at all. But I like it. It's okay. It's different. And it's not a bad different. I like that a lot. Now, there's this little thing that pops off the top here, which leads me to believe that you can buy one with a camera and put that on there. This is a phone mounting hole, you know, like phone mounting system up there. So they probably do have a camera version, but if I were you guys, I would just go with the non-camera version. I like this a lot. I didn't really get to show you the drone folding and unfolding. I hear Amelia, so this has got to be fast now. <laughs> but this little guy folds up nice and small, which I like a lot. Look at that. And, and that flight time was just amazing. Such a sharp little, little drone. And then you get four spare props, a Phillips screwdriver, and a little USB charge cable to charge the flight battery plus the instructions. I like this drone, definitely a huge winner in my book. I'll have it linked in the description box below. That is awesome. Guys, thanks a lot for watching. I hope you are enjoying the nice warm weather if you're getting it, or hopefully it's coming around the corner as much as we are, because this hobby, that's just what it's all about, getting outside and having some fun with the family. Thanks a lot for watching. We'll see you in the next video. Bye.